we have a very big problem of gender-based violence in this country. Um, and I think that the change will only start if we start to speak up. Um, it needs to stop, guys. It's not okay. And um, you need to know that if you have been a victim of this and this has happened to you, you have not done anything wrong. Um, and it is absolutely okay to stand up for yourself. Um, and it doesn't matter what anybody thinks. And don't worry, um, my biggest thing uh, was would people believe me? And that was my biggest thing. Um, and the second thing was would it affect my work? You know, as a female, I genuinely believe we're always fighting double time against um, the opportunities that men have. So I didn't want to create any problems for myself. I just wanted to make sure that I was successful at all costs and um, although that's what I may have wanted I realized that putting this I literally stored this under a rug and I hoped that I would forget about it but I, n I never dealt with it and um, <laughs> listening to to a podcast like that uh, having it played back to me I cannot believe that somebody would fabricate that amount of lies uh, for years I was traumatized I, I remember literal fa flashbacks of my younger sister and I literally running away from the house because we were afraid we were afraid of what would happen to us um, and now I, I'm in such a position where I, I'm empowered I'm strong and I know that God is in control I'm not afraid of you um, and it's wrong what you did you took the virginity of a woman who was saving herself for marriage not once but you continuously raped me for two years. My spirit almost died. I almost died. I tried to kill myself twice because of what you did. But you know what? I'm so grateful. I don't regret anything that has happened to me. I think I've come out stronger. A lot of people ask me, how come I'm able to keep going that much more? Um, why it is I'm so resilient um, and so strong. And I, this is it. This is the proof. Um, when, when, when you've gone through so much and you still choose to overcome, like, I'm in a place where I'm fearless. I'm not afraid of you, okay?